Hi guys! Welcome back to Cosmetics YouTube channel. Today we're going to be speaking all things pride. If you would like to see how I created this warm tone, cool tone rainbow look, stay tuned for more. So today I'll be using the Catrice Pore Minimizing Serum. This is my favorite serum in the range. So be sure to go check out the serum video on our channel. So, Pride Month, and what does Pride mean to me? Well, Pride Month means quite a lot to me because I came out in creating, <laughs> I guess. But like, it wasn't like, you know how every gay person has this like dramatic like, come out and everyone's just like, oh my gosh. It wasn't like that for me. My mother and I were watching Empire, believe it or not, and we just like, there was a scene with Cookie Lion where she was like, where she told Jamal, if you haven't watched that, please go watch it. Um, where she told Jamal that like she has him, she got his back and whatever. And my mom did that exact same thing to me. And she was just like, immediately after the scene, by the way. <laughs> and she told me like, I love you and I know. And you know, and for me, that was the best because like, I didn't have to pluck up this courage to like sit my parents down and tell my parents, listen. I like boys but I mean it is what it is I respect everyone's coming out story so like with pride it means a lot to me I love the people in my community um, all the gays the lesbians the pansexuals the transgenders especially the transgenders uh, for primer today I'll be going in with the hello good stuff face primer I absolutely love this primer first time I used it was for the pretty natural foundation review and I'm hooked now so in any case with regards to pride i feel like we've come a long way with regards to acceptance with regards to open-mindedness okay so i'll be doing a bit of a reverse application i know i started with skincare and my primer but i'm gonna let that primer settle into my skin and while i do that i'm going to obviously do my brows then my eyes and continue with the rest of the face so today i'll be using the essence brow powder brow set this is actually one of my favorite products and it's a goodie and an oldie to Essence and to us. But before we get into all the chit chat, all the tea about pride, my coming out story, uh, my makeup journey, I'm just going to do my brows off camera and I'll be back. So get a snack because it's going to be a journey. Okay, and I'm back. So I literally just did my brows off camera. What I used was obviously the Essence Brow Powder Set that I showed you guys and then I also love, love, love this concealer. It's the Catrice Liquid Camouflage High Coverage Concealer in the shade 48. Okay, so the first like ever piece of makeup I've ever used was a brow pencil. Up until today, I'm still a brow pencil fan. My favorite brow pencil at the moment is the Catrice Slimatic. Slimatic. Cinematic brow pencil, the one that comes with the spoolie at the end. I absolutely love that because, like, then you don't really need one of these. That was like one of my first, first makeup products I purchased. And I used to have the proper shop right there. I was like, they, they were not as fluffy as this. They were block, honey. They were block. Okay, so I'll just go in with the Catrice 5 in 1 setting powder just to set my lids. So I'll just take my normal blending brush and actually get some powder on this brush and then just... It doesn't really matter how you apply the powder because you're just setting the eye. And lately I've been seeing this like trend on TikTok where people use actual tissues and an eyeshadow palette to create a rainbow look and I feel like that's exactly what we're gonna do today. Our eyes are primed um, and today I'm going to be using the Essence range, the eyeshadow palettes which everyone loves, the Daily Dose of Power eyeshadow palette, the Daily Dose of Energy eyeshadow palette and the Daily Dose of Love eyeshadow palette. So each of these eyeshadow palettes come with a little message inside just to motivate you while you're doing your makeup. Like for example, the Daily Dose of Love eyeshadow palette actually comes with a little saying that says Self Love Club. And that's exactly what we're here for. Self Love. And obviously Pride. 
Okay, I'm scared. <laughs> this is the first time I have not. So normally I will practice a look before I do it. So this is the first time I'm doing this look with the tissue. So let's do it. Okay, so I'm going in with the purple shade. Just going to use my hand just to softly blend that out. So then I'm going to be using another clean tissue for the blues. Maybe I should take that advice, go get a life, or maybe get a job or something. Okay, now that we've done the blue, I just want to go back in with the purple just to make sure that the purple does not get hidden. Purple, blue, and then some green. So I should just step in there and apply that all in the inner part of the lid. And a little message in the power palette says, yay for today. And obviously we are definitely celebrating pride today. So I'm just going to reapply that color. Right, so that is the cool tone side all complete. So now I'm going to go in with the energy palette as well as a little bit of the love palette to create the warm tone side. Okay, so for the warm tone side, we are going in with red, orange, and yellow. So let's just dip into the red already, just like that. Ooh, she is so pigmented. She is pretty. And then we're going in with the orange tone in the palette. And then we're just placing that in the middle, just like that. Okay, so I'm not gonna end here. I'm going to cut the lid with the Catrice Liquid Camouflage Concealer in the shade 48 again. Alright, then I am going to put a shimmer there. I actually love the shade Believe in Miracles. So I'm going in with the Catrice All Around Concealer Palette. The, just a little tip, the green neutralizes any redness and the orange which I'm going to be using today neutralizes dark circles and dark marks. And I'm going to apply it in my beard area. For foundation, I'm using my absolute favorite, the Catrice True Skin Hydrating Foundation. I am shade 70, warm caramel. It's going to highlight the key areas of my face. Maybe I should take that advice, go get a life, or maybe get a job or something. Pack it up and head back home, tell everybody I was bluffing. Maybe I'll just get out my head and focus on what I know's coming. Okay, so I'll be going in for contouring today. I'll be going in with the Catrice Hydrating Foundation in the shade 94, which is warm cocoa. Okay, so I'll be going in with the Catrice 5-in-1 setting powder. It's mattifying, it's sweat proof, and it needs to be in your kit. Okay, so we are now going in with some blush, and I'm going to be using Essence, the blush in the shade Breathtaking. Then whatever's left on my brush, I'm just going to run on my chin, the nose, forward just to bring everything together all right now that that's done i am going to finish off the eyes okay so i actually feel like blowing this out a bit more so i'm going to take my red shadow and actually just blow it out a lot more onto the side as well as the pink i mean yeah the pink and purple mixture that i've concocted get up and head back home tell everybody i was bluffing 
Ash had another idea. <laughs> I'm gonna take a little bit of that blue and also just like that. I'm gonna take whatever's left for the green and then also just stamp it on like that. I'm back. I'm bad. I'm bougie. <laughs> so I'm going to be using the Glam and Doll Mascara, the waterproof one. The packaging is actually made of 80% recycled plastic, which we are here for always. Guess who's back in the house? So for highlighter today, I'm using the Essence, the highlighter in the shade Sun Showers. I used this in my Pretty Natural review and absolutely love it. So I'm just gonna really get in there because I want that luminous glow. Then I'm going to take a thin little eyeshadow blush for the nose highlight. So we have popped on the highlighter. I'm just going to give myself a good spritz of the Essence Fix and Last 18 hour makeup fixing spray. I feel like a lot of influencers, I feel like everyone's sleeping on this actually. You guys need to try this. This smells amazing and it is affordable and you can find it at Clicks, you can find it at Diskin, you can find it on Superbulous, you can find it where you need to find it. <laughs> okay, so today I'm going in with the Juicy Bomb Lip Gloss in the shade Lovely Raspberry. Okay, so this is the completed Pride look. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big, thick thumbs up like comment and subscribe and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the segments where i actually did speak about pride and like my own personal journey um personally my favorite product today after this entire makeup look had to have been these babies the true skin foundation and the eyeshadow palette which is the essence daily dose of love daily dose of power and daily dose of energy so all I can say is continue having that daily dose of energy to get up every day and be who you are. Continue to have that daily dose of love, showing everyone in the Essence family and in the world, showing them love, showing, showing them pride, showing them who you are. And lastly, you have that daily dose of power to be the change in the world. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.